Okay, this is Biggie Doo with my lightning fast VidCon review. I've actually done a couple of these that uh, just failed. Um, first off, VidCon was the first ever VidCon video conferencing uh, type of deal. And um, once YouTube got a hold of how awesome it was going to be, they decided to, uh, you know, show up and do a cool uh, thing talking about the lean back device that's going to really change a lot of stuff, you know, bringing video to the television with uh, the Google TV that's coming out and, um, you know, going to 4096 by 4096. So it's true, 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 amazing stuff. Um, bottom line is this. VidCon was amazing. When you, anytime you have more than 50% of the, the most 100 subscribed people of all time, uh, you know it's going to be a great, great venue. Um, it was set up wonderfully. You had some, some main stage stuff and some breakout sessions that people could, you know, you did your meetups there, and uh, there was an insider track that uh, a lot of people uh, got a lot of new tips and information of how to market themselves better. And um, basically, you know, YouTube is, you know, just five years old. But, you know, in the next five years, a lot of the stars that we have on YouTube today are going to be in the mainstream. And that's kind of where, that's kind of what we found out from this conference is it's going to happen. And uh, it was really wonderful just to meet everybody and to uh, hang out with a bunch of people. And, uh, you know, for me, it was, the personal experience that I got is that sometimes, you know, being a professional music teacher, I, uh, I don't make videos as much or, you know, and I, I view YouTube as just like a fun thing. Um, even though a lot of people watch my reviews and watch my, you know, silly songs that I make up because I'm an Im improvisational musician. Um, basically it's it's all changing you know people are making a lot of money off of this some of the big youtubers are well in the you know five to ten thousand dollars a month category and uh it's it's crazy where just to think where this could be you know in the future but uh it was it was great meeting all these people that uh are just like you and myself and uh they, it was incredible it was just an incredible experience and, uh, you know, I hung out with some really wonderful, awesome people. And uh, it's just going to be one of those things. This was, I, I call this the, the Woodstock of YouTube because nobody will ever forget VidCon. You know, there's been gatherings in the past, you know, the 789, the 888 out in Toronto. Um, VidCon was amazing because you had so many of everybody there. And it's going to change everything. It's going to change everything. Uh, so many videos were made there. So many great experiences. And uh, I think that the next VidCon, it, there will be another one. Because just the overwhelming um, reception was that great. It'll probably still be in L.A. You know, as much as I want it to be on the East Coast. Because it's only like four hours away to like New York City or something. Um, VidCon will probably stay in LA because it was just that easy for everybody to get there. And that's probably why it was that amazingly successful. And, uh, that's what's up. Um, there's so many other great videos that you can watch from VidCon. Just look up, just search VidCon from, uh, you know, your computer or whatnot. And you know, see everything that happened. See, uh, if you, if you haven't made many videos or, or want to be inspired, you can see, like, all these people that have have just started, everybody starts from nowhere, you know, and uh, just see how they built their channels and how they are now monetizing it, and it's, it's incredible how this journey has happened for so many people, and uh, that's what's up, so that's, that's my my thing of VidCon, all right, VidCon was the game changer, it's the Woodstock of our YouTube generation, so it was great to be a part of it. Peace.